because whenever she plays her first game, doesn't matter how well you will play, you will lose. The atmosphere building this great occasion, the world of sport watching, and the players ready and waiting. When you play Serena, stepping also on the court, apart from holding your emotion, you have to play so well to beat her. The Australian Open Championship of 2009 from Russia, Yanara Sabna. Sometimes like it's not only enough to play your best game, you also think like, okay, she has to play a little bit less than you. So it's it's uh, it's a lot of pressure you feel on the court. Nara Safina knows she's going to have to step it up against uh, the number two seed here. And remember, the number one ranking is on the line tonight, and that is that just adds a little bit more to the result of this final. She has to play aggressive. She has to stay positive, and she knows that she's going to have to step it up from the previous matches. Because whenever she plays her best game, doesn't matter how well you will play, you will lose. Serena Williams to get us underway. It's it just diff it was different level. So much expectation about the performance of this young lady coming in. It's all been blown out of the water. That is as Jane. comprehensive a set Cross as set, you are Williams. ever going to see in a Grand Slam final. Six love, 22 minutes. It appears as though Safina is to going to need a miracle. Everyone is shell-shocked. You know, and sometimes you want to win, my emotions took over blocked me from desire to win this title, you know, especially with, against Serena, we were fighting to be in a run, who wins, and and I guess she was just more experienced, you know, holding her emotions. I didn't know how to handle it. Well, that just about sums it up. This whole night has been about conquering your nerves, and this is more mental than anything else. I still, like now, sometimes I think about those moments, you know, that, and it's a little bit, like, heartbreaking for me, because, um, that I didn't have anybody who could teach me how to handle my emotion. <laughs> and uh, that I didn't have a chance, you know, to hold the trophy. Yes, uh, I have been three times in the final. After a while, you know, you say like, well, I guess this was my destiny, I don't know. <laughs> so, but I still, I did the best I could. Good evening, everybody. And not much to say, I didn't even spend one hour on the court. <laughs> well, of course, I would like to congratulate uh, Serena. I think she played just too good today. I was just a ball boy on the court today. <laughs> Definitely Denara, who's going to have such a great future. Um, she's playing, hitting so hard, I just have to just go for broke against her. So it was all I could do today. That wasn't the best memory I have. But still, when I stopped, I'm like, but still those emotions, I don't care, good, bad but you have emotions. And it's very difficult to find those emotions outside of, of the game.